everybody! Welcome to more Genshin Impact! Yay! I'm very excited that we can do more of the... Arpole... Arpolegio? Arpolegio? What is it? I don't... Islands! The island thing! Yeah, whatever. We're gonna do more of that! Woo! Archipelago. 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 Thank you. So we want to do this one, I think. This is the Golden Apple Archipelago. <laughs> Which I think is timed, right? We have to like finish it before the event goes away. Sometimes the law is compatible with human head nature, to, but sometimes the two conflict. Okay. Okay. Balancing the two is a discipline in its own right. Thank you for the advice. But we're switching to Venti. Okay, <laughs> let's go here. We've got to go. Oh, right there. We can even go to an uninhabited island together. <laughs> he meant here, I think, in his letter. Rest until the next morning. There's... Well, is there even any wine here? What am I supposed to do with these just empty pots? Oh, a conch. Let's listen to this. We can't let the size of the ocean intimidate us. We have to at least try. You think we haven't tried before? We can't afford to lose anyone else. All right, nice. All right, sorry, Venti. You're just gonna have to chill with no wine and no apples. This island is really letting me down already. <laughs> oh! The weather's so nice. <gasps> Still feels like I'm on streaming. We slept. Hype train! Level one. What's with everyone's clothes? What? What's wrong with our clothes? <gasps> so cute. How do we look? What does the traveler get? One? We changed into summer clothes. You didn't bring Although me one. Ducky! Have fun. We don't want to miss out on a beautiful summer day by the sea. That ducky, I want that ducky purse uh, in real this life. Doesn't look weird, does it? No, you look great. Such light and summery clothing definitely doesn't suit me. Now you look fantastic. Uh, thank you, traveler. You're welcome, Jean. It's surprising that Master Jean would specially pack summer clothes. I know we didn't pack any clothes. Oh, Nobody told us to pack no. any clothes. My big sister would never pack these herself. Lisa and I picked them out for her. Learning how big. Sister and not even realizing it? Barb was drunk on summer Is it bad to say big sister? There's quite a story behind these. <laughs> Paimon hates siblings. I thought Lisa's pouch was to be used for an emergency. I didn't expect it to contain a set of summer clothing. All these accessories, too. Definitely Lisa's handiwork. Everyone, I want to wear those. Come over here. I would wear Jean's outfit. That's Clee's voice. Like, that looks like an outfit I would buy. <laughs> I saw something weird. What's up, Clee? Why aren't what you wearing you a cute outfit? Weird? I mean, your outfit's cute Look already, the ocean. I guess. There's something weird floating on the water. Isabella, thank you for cheering. A device. It seems to be a buoy. Well, we didn't see anything when we arrived here yesterday. Dodo King must have put them there. <gasps> Photo King, Strange I forgot about him. Devices that just appear overnight? Something doesn't add up. That was suspicious. Well, since he hasn't revealed himself to us, does that mean he's changed his mind? No, or maybe, no, no, it's okay, baby Clee. Maybe these okay. buoys are a clue, and he's waiting for me to find him. Maybe. So could that be why these buoys have suddenly appeared? Let's take a closer look and find out. Just in case, prepare yourselves for combat. Aye, aye, Once you Jean. are ready, please assemble here, and we'll head over on the boat together. Dodo King must have placed those things in the ocean. Mm. He's a bad guy. He's a bad guy. I will bravely face him and do my best for Dodoko. <laughs> Miss Honorary Knight, thank you for helping me. You're welcome. Boat, come hither, please. Avast. Time for exploration. Should I shoot it? Kill it? Seems like a bad way to investigate. Oh, all right. It looks like something ah. sunk down to the seabed. Maybe it's the buoy's energy that released when it was destroyed. So they really were oh. set up by Dodo King. Let's keep going. All right. What if they're made by some, you know, like the Coast Guard or something? We the second one. Ooh, one will shot. Will Dodo King appear after That's we break awesome. them all? Pew! That's the last of them. Yeah. Oh, is the shape awesome. getting stronger? Hurry, back to shore. Oh, okay. Ah! Wee! Traveler should get us somewhere out for two! The sound. <gasps> Are we draining the ocean? What did we do? Did we wake up a beast? This seems. This is why we shouldn't just go blowing things up out of nowhere. Uh, that's what Klee does, I know, but, like, we shouldn't do that. Uh-oh. Whoa! This is a tall island now, with a beach! That's fun. What's happening? Everybody okay? Wow, so pretty. Wow. It's a whole bunch of islands. 
Even more than before. Do the king, do the king, I'm gonna catch you. <laughs> With the entire archipelago situated on a mechanical framework, climb really it could be activated to raise <laughs> each island from beneath the water. Something like that would be nothing short of a miracle. Could it be the power of the Animo Archon Barbados? That's me. Mm, probably not. Hey. Paimon feels like this is more likely oh. a deliberate setup. All right, you're saying that it's I just go with the blow. No matter true. how you think of it, using a letter to draw us here and these challenges involving various mechanisms, the so-called Dodo King is no amateur. I found him! It's Dodo King! What? He's over there on that island! Eh? <laughs> gotcha! What? You want me to come find you, so here Klee comes! Uh-oh. Jumpy dumpties, get ready! Wait, wait, Klee, 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 Wait for us! A platform in the middle of the ocean? Go to the central platform. Okay. Is there more stuff on this island, though? Treasure? Ah! Ooh, a conch. Grandpa, everyone else has decided to leave. You're the only one left. Please, Grandpa, trust me. Just this once. I promise you, I've found the way out. They're all trapped. Very well. I will give you my trust. All of our fates now lie in your hands. These are very ominous conches. What's in the square? Once you have entered the painted ground, your normal attacks will be changed to the dodge guard. No, to the dodo guard. You can use the dodo guard to return windblessed harpastia. Harpastia. Pasta. Harpasta. <laughs> Throw a windblessed harpastum and hit the dodo king's painted wall to begin the challenge. Throw a dodo guard to return a windblessed harpasta and strike the dodo guard's painted wall. Once you accumulate a certain number of hits, you can destroy the wall. Okay. Where's the wall? There it is. Yeah. That didn't work. I don't have the gadget for it yet. Oh. What's this? Oh. Adjust your angle and throw it. I don't have our pasta yet. The hymnal rings. Okay, I can't do this yet. Okay. Is that the King Dodo? Dodo King? Looks kind of like an old man with a big beard. Oh, it's a mask. Everyone, please be careful. Okay. Huh? Is it too? Or is that a really tall person? It resembles a human, but something's not quite right. Does it resemble a human? King, I see you. She just you looks can, like a big uh, mask to uh, me. Uh, arbo arbitrate. <laughs> right, you can arbitrate Klee. <laughs> uh, what is this kid saying? <laughs> She obviously doesn't understand what that word means. <laughs> hey, Dodo King, why are you ignoring me? Is it because I took too long and made you angry? Oh. Then I'm sorry. Clee! Huh? Clee. And now she's apologizing. Oh, didn't see that coming. Never saw Hello, it coming. Hello, Dodo King. It looks like they're not interested in Clee at all. Dodo King, you better talk to Clee it's right some now. Some kind of humanoid machine. Yeah, this is clearly no not her response. Person. It must I think be we're damaged. Have to fight this. <laughs> Do you recognize it? No, I can only guess. Watch out, Jean. It it's going to come to life. It's completely out of place on this island. Look at its clothes. It appears like it came from Inazuma. Oh, it does look like a person, Inazuma? actually. Inazuma? But isn't that really far away? So this machine isn't from around here? It would appear so. This area of the sea is independent and does not border any country. Oh. So it certainly seems out of place here. But given Inazuma's current situation, how could something like this occur? An abandoned machine? Weird. Weird. Did someone bring it here? Oh no, Dodo King isn't moving anymore. Uh, don't get too close. Klee, <laughs> maybe Dodo King is tired. <laughs> right, right! The Dodo King is probably asleep. <laughs> he was waiting so patiently for you, and then... Ah! Nap time. Oh. Let's go with Klee to play elsewhere and oh. come back once <laughs> Dodo King wakes up. No, I get it now. This isn't Dodo King. The real Dodo King is somewhere else. Sure. Huh. <laughs> is that right? I won't give up. We're gonna follow Dodo this King little girl around. We'll She's the whole you. world. Look here. Rocks. Look at these stacked up stones and small flowers. It feels like a memorial for someone. Oh, you're very perceptive. Hey, you're embarrassing me. Oh. <laughs> but the only other thing around here is that machine in Inazuman clothing. Could the memorial be for the machine? <laughs> Everything we've seen here indicates that there was once a human presence in these the waters. the biggest mask in the land. Still, there isn't enough for us to yeah, infer what kind of like, civilization it was. <sighs> Sorry I killed you. Still you get to see any people or Lauren stones. Landa, thank you Master for raiding. Hey, Lauren. 
Yes, but be careful. Be careful, okay. Klee. Klee, what's wrong? What's wrong, Klee? Do you Klee? think that Dodo King doesn't want to see you, Klee? No, Klee, no, no, no. Why would the no. Dodo King not want to see you, Klee? You're awesome, Klee. Dodo we love Klee you. Loves Everyone me. loves and, you. And I love Dodo Ko, so Dodo oh. King can never separate us. Oh. That's why Dodo King doesn't want to see us. Klee no. doesn't want him to separate us. Don't cry. <laughs> We're gonna kill this Dodo King for making hey, her cry. Hey, do you know what this is? Whoa, a bouncy ball. It's a hard pass dome. We need that for the mini games. Uh, Master Jean say that Klee always wanted to play hard pass dome, right? Yeah, Klee was just thinking about. I Lee always wanted to play it too. Ever since I found I out about it two minutes ago. Especially for you. Now, can I have one? Every day can be Ludi hard pass dome. <laughs> <laughs> Yay! After we meet Dodo King, we can all help you convince him to let you and Dodo Ko stay together. Let's double our efforts. We have to find him. I love that we're on a little girl strip. <laughs> so cute. Where's the conch? Ah! There you are. Mother says you're not one of us, but you protected us, didn't you, General? Oh, I forgot. Uh, you won't talk to me. Sad. Mother also says that your hometown is far away from here, just like ours. Oh, are they talking so to far the away Dodo King? None of us even know where it is. Or that guy General, over there that might not be the Dodo King? You ever miss your home? But they're talking to that thing. Whoa. Oh, yes. To do what am i supposed to do dang it i can't leave the square okay don't leave the square 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 don't leave yeah first try again <laughs> clee jean barbara where are you honorary night oh my gosh good morning, morning. did you have a good rest barbara you're Good morning, traveler. You're all dressed Jean, in your regular clothes. Your clothes. Yeah, Jean, why did you change back? Well, this is a complex and evolving situation, so we should be ready for any eventuality. For security reasons, we changed back into more combat-ready attire, even though it may not allow us to make the most of the surroundings. My apologies. Right. Now I don't feel as left out, oh, so don't it's apologize. okay. It's in everyone's best interest. Mm-hmm. Well, that certainly takes the fun out of things. Back to work already. Ladies and gentlemen, the Knights of Favonius acting Grandmaster. Impressive willpower. Good job, Jean. Sorry, Paima, and I, I almost cut you off there. I didn't want to risk you, but I noticed some white smoke coming from one of the other islands. I think it'd be best if we went and investigated it together. It must be Dodo King. Even Paimon's starting to believe that this Dodo King might actually show up. Ooh. I'm also keen to lay uh, eyes on this so-called Dodo, Dodo King. All of you, follow me. Let's investigate. Let's investigate. Oh, hey! Hey, I know you guys! Look, there are two figures over there. We know them. Mm, it looks like. Hello! Hmm? Did you bring wine? Hmm? What Pirates! The heck are they doing here? I'm not surprised you're on an island. It's Kaya you're a pirate. And a weird I knew it. Up. I had no idea we'd run into you here. An unexpected pleasure. So it's not Dodo King? Dodo, Dodo King. King. Dodo huh. King. Hmm. So it was Dodo King that invited you to these oh, islands. Oh, Akaya, you don't seem surprised. What a coincidence. Wait, what did do you, you guys get invited by Dodo I'll King? I'll get too? to that. But first, I want Answer to enjoy question, some Kaya. more of this island sunshine. Master D Luke might actually get a tan. <laughs> Wait, did you two sail here? How did you get past the storms and fog? Storms and fog? We must have gotten lucky. When we arrived, there wasn't a patch of fog in sight. We cleared it up for you. You're welcome. Now it feels like I'm on vacation. But as you know, a boat wouldn't have made it over. We had no choice but to use the same method of transport. You talked to Venti and used Dvalin? Huh? You mean Dvalin carried you here too? You seem surprised. Dragon flights are a fairly conspicuous affair. Eye-catching oh, one could Everyone say. saw us flying away Wait, on a dragon. so everyone <laughs> found out that I... It would seem that people noticed a dragon, but not necessarily the cargo. Oh, they didn't know it was Still, us. Still, okay. word spread quickly that a dragon was in town. Dragon! Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> Who knew that everyone's favorite She's bard... She's like, I don't want to be associated with dragons. ...had the power to summon dragons. What if... If people knew that I like dragons, they won't take me seriously. Uh, uh, they'll think I'm too girly. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, jeez. Has he discovered that Fenty is... 
Venti is cool. That Venti is the best bard in the land. I guess Devalin must be a diehard fan of classical ballads. Totally, yeah. Any bard wow. could summon him, probably. Uh, <laughs> I, I assume you two traveled here together? <laughs> you assume the acting grandmaster's jokes have improved of late. Do we seem like fitting travel companions to you? <laughs> there were actually two <laughs> others that arrived with us on the island. So they wandered off unenduced. for various reasons. <laughs> Various reasons? Let's just say that big egos aren't conducive to team cohesion. You mean they abandoned you? <laughs> <laughs> An incisive observation. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Nothing ever gets past the honorary night. I know. Very intuitive. So, who are the two others? Yeah. Albedo and Razor. Oh, we like huh? them. We know all these Albedo people. Albedo and Razor? Ah. <laughs> Tell us you all came here for a vacation. Yeah! Wait, they went on a voice here. Trip. <laughs> Who was overseeing the Knights of Favonius? The mighty librarian Lisa, of course. Oh, mighty Not librarian. In some ways, she's stricter than either of us. Any evildoers in Mondstadt need to watch out for the next several days. Watch out! Thankfully, Lisa's there. Where did all yeah, Lisa's and scary. Razor go? Like, I think we're also, everyone's. It's fine. What was that white smoke I just saw? Ah, uh, yes. That. Oh, I want that I thing in the water. start with how we ended up here. That. We arrived by dragon, the way. but as soon as we entered the island's vicinity, something caught Razor's eye. He jumped straight off of the dragon's back and vanished into the ocean. That's dangerous. We worried that he'd be oh, in no. danger. Did he so drown? we also leapt off the dragon and glided onto this island. But as you can see, this is but a deserted land. Based on previous experience, I decided that it would be best to wait for contact, while d -Luke believed that Razor wouldn't return to find us. Mm. During our little dispute, I'll Beto quietly disappeared on us. Must have found something he's more interested in. Very coy. Hold on! <laughs> How come he was able to walk off, but you two are stuck here? Yeah, where'd he go? Did he walk on water? <laughs> Who knows? Perhaps we're fated to be doomed together. Ah, uh, right, besties. Master D. Luke? Best friends. <laughs> Is that they don't seem like so. they like each other that much. Albedo Fire is an ice. alchemist don't mix. and skilled at his craft. If I could use those beautiful artificial flowers of his, it would be a simple affair to traverse Sibling these rivalry. islands. For some reason, I remember that our initial landing zone was the island over there with the higher mountains. Oh. Only at your insistence did we change course and land here. Oh my, but your footsteps melted the water that I took such effort to freeze. <laughs> Who made Cryo and Pyro so incompatible? That's what I said, Fire and I still mix. If you had a geovision, <laughs> I'd be long asleep on one of the other islands. <laughs> They're so, so rude to I each saw other. What earlier was just steam from vaporized water? Oh. I still can't tell if you guys are really close or hate each other's <laughs> guts. <laughs> Me too. Uh, regardless. Brothers, you know. Things seem to be so livelier now, are. which is good. Yes, it is a boon to have extra allies in an unknown situation. <gasps> join our crew! We're gonna be Please such a big group on this boat. Ah! Sure. I don't know if you guys but can fit course. in our boat. It's pretty small. Our top priority is to it. find Albedo and Razor. Do you know which direction they went? For now, it's impossible to locate Razor. As for Albedo, he went that way. That away! And there's no time to All lose! Right. Let's go look for him! Let's go! It's getting dark, though. Here we go. Conch! Hey, I found it! The other half of the ship, it's here! Uh, after everything we went through with the army, all our hard-won treasure is gone, and so's the ship. When Chief Janome finds out, we'll be in for the scolding of a lifetime. This samurai puppet is all that's left. <gasps> we met that samurai puppet. And we're no more capable of getting out of here on our own so strength So it wasn't a person, it, it was a puppet! We're unraveling the mystery, one conch at a time. <laughs> we made it! Oh, this island is really big! Where could he be? Mr. Alpha? I could eat some Alfredo right now. Come out, come out, wherever you are. Paimon? <gasps> we found him, Koidao. What's up? came out of nowhere behind us. Mr. Albedo. Hello. Hello, everyone. I thought that we might convene around this time. Hello, where'd you I go? I trust you enjoyed your stroll. How'd you walk over here? How kind of you to maroon us on that neighboring island. Yeah, it's rude. Oh, please, don't mention it. I felt that the two of you could do with some alone time. <laughs> Albedo, They were probably fighting, and he was here? like, enough of this, I'm out of here. received a letter. On the way over, the four of us shared what we knew. A mysterious letter appeared outside each of our doors. Ooh, from the Dodo King? They were all King? signed <gasps> Dodo King. Dodo King! Anyone else find it hard not to crack a smile when Master d -Luke says, Dodo King? <laughs> Everyone's letter was different, yet all of them drew us to this archipelago. What did the letter say? My letter was very simple. I have Klee. Oh. If you wish to see her, come to the Golden Apple Archipelago. Here she is. Oh, that 
It's blackmail. Doodle King's trying to coerce you. Yeah, she's okay. Correct. It would appear that I have been successfully coerced. <laughs> My letter was similarly straightforward. Among the deserted islands, you will find a sunken pirate ship. Within lies great treasure. Because he's a pirate. I, t I knew it. Of incredible I called that the moment I saw him. <laughs> that he was a it pirate. It would appear he that someone came treasure? to learn of the circumstances totally. surrounding the eye patch that my grandfather left me. Classic he's a pirate. He's a pirate. He can take his eye patch about. off. I was right. Anyway, so what's your story, D. Luke? Yeah, what, what did yours there say? There is an abyss order stronghold among the deserted islands. Make haste. Oh, yours is very you important. You have to admire their strategy. The right bait for the right fish. Guy is just like so money, strange. please. No, everyone else so has nice. like reasons to come but that aren't money. <laughs> King gather everyone here? This mm. is indeed a mysterious Maybe case. the Dodo King just wanted I to have a cool summer party. With. And we're all invited, yes. but he's shy. It so would he didn't appear know how to that the grown-ups among us came here primarily to understand what was behind the curtain. Didn't Razor get a letter too? Yeah, where's where's Razor? He did, though he couldn't read it. No. A certain kind-hearted, cat-eared gentleman that he encountered on the way over was able to relay the contents to him. Oh, what is that? Kind-hearted, cat-eared gentleman. We know gentleman? some cat-eared people. Yeah, draft. Draft, right? Yeah. The content of Razor's letter was no more complex. The red Bernie girl has gone to the islands. She needs help. Having heard the contents oh, of the letters, please, the red it Bernie became girl. abundantly clear that something wasn't right. I don't believe this so-called oh. Dodo King exists, <laughs> but there is someone or something. Why did Razor jump out before he together. found Clee then? No, no. Dodo King is real. He's Dodo King. If you say so. Yeah, all right. Something caught Razor's attention on the journey over, or what he wouldn't it? have leaped from the dragon's back. Yeah, where? I've examined this island. His footprints are nowhere to be found, and there's no sign of a boat having left. Based on our position and bearing when he made the jump, if he didn't land here, then he must have made his way over there. Oh, that platform! Oh, we probably saw the, the guy. You've already been there? Yeah, there's like we a were there dead guy. A few days ago. <laughs> there was a mysterious machine. Jean said that it came from Inazuma. Could that be what caught Razor's attention? Uh, let's head to the central platform. Okay. I found you, Conch. The tides are getting higher by the year. If the water level rises much further, we will stand very little chance Are these chance Conches of all from people that used to live in like an ancient civilization here, maybe? There's God. no other choice. Covered in water? I must tell everyone to pack up their belongings and move to higher ground. Mother! Mother! What's wrong? The tide reached us. Uh -oh. So I told everyone to run and get to higher ground. But the family heirloom. Sorry. No. It was a choice between that and getting everyone to safety. So oh, I... no. I didn't have enough time to get it. You made the right choice. Humans over it's things. It's right in the center of the island. If the water recedes some time, or if someone gets in from outside, we'll just have to get them to find it for us. Very interesting. I'm very intrigued by this mystery. Uh... <gasps> the conch! As long as we stay on this course, following the waves, we just need one good, strong gust of wind. Well, as it happens, the wind direction changes in quite a unique way when the moon rises at this time of the year. Oh. Really? Are you sure? Yep. I know the winds in these seas like the back of my hand. Back of my hand? There's a journal here, too! Let's see what it says. I'm just gonna take a little picture of this so that I remember what it says, because I will definitely not. It all seems like important information. <laughs> there you are. Hello. The grown-ups say you come from a faraway land and that you're dressed like an army general. Hey, don't you want to talk to me? If not, it's okay if I give you this flower, right? All right. Well, cool. Oh, Razor! Hey, Razor! Ruh, 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 ruh. Oh, woo. Look, over there! Hello. Razor! Hi! Everyone, I am here. <laughs> Razor, <laughs> Very good. Are you okay? Are you hurt? Do you need healing? No need. Okay. Don't jump off a dragon. What are you doing here? I... Smelled something. This gift to you. Is this a part of the machine? Clear smell. Same as letter. A smelly Razor piece did of mention that his letter had a peculiar smell. You sure have a great sense of smell, Razor. Did Dodo King factor that in too? Oh. Also, this one and that one, same smell. This thing put inside metal person. Same. What? Here. Whoa. Me? Yes. I don't understand how. Traveler is clever, Razor. Trusts. Yeah, Clee trusts the honorary should, knight too. You should trust me. I'm very trustworthy. Not so fast. Oh. We need to think this through. Why, you don't trust what me? What will happen if we reinsert the missing component? I am a great this patron of your bar. could well be so. something that Dodo King left here for us to find and activate. It 
might reawaken Dodo King himself. Ooh. Then we will be ready for him, honorary knight. I'm ready. Prepare yourself. So ready. My team's so strong. We really wanted to meet Dodo King. We're great. That's why we came here, right? You're right. Let's do this. Venti won't be much help in this fight. How dare you? <laughs> He's helpful in all fights. Okay. Uh. All right. Let's go. Wait. Did did it move? Uh oh. He's very tall. What a tricksy little armor. Think you can get away? I know you said he was immune, but I, I don't you care. Ah! And then this, and then that, and then yeah, and the hi yeah, and the rah. Shudder. Shudder. Hey. Die, 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 die. Die, 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 die. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, just let me kill you. Very rude. Okay. Finally. Woo. Look. What's that? Are those Ooh, crystals? Pretty. You should ask the expert. Oh, let's hope your faith in me is not misplaced. <laughs> Before we get to the crystals, why don't we start with the machine itself? Our previous conjecture was correct. This giant in Inazuma attire is a machine modeled on the human form. Was it built for fighting? Like ruin guards? I'm afraid so. It possesses significant combat capabilities and seems to be autonomous. But for it to attack us indiscriminately like this, I believe it must have been damaged some time ago. Its outward appearance oh. confirms its Inazuma origin. But, broke it. as far as I know, Inazuma is still under the Sakaku Decree. How the could Hudo such what, what? a massive piece of offensive weaponry have found its way here? It the fact that the I haven't done a lot of the main story, I feel like I'm supposed to know a lot more about things than I do. People? <laughs> Just like, oh, I'm yes. Sure, the shrewdest that. among you have already come sure. to the same conclusion. I These agree. These deserted islands bear signs of human activity. <laughs> I would go so far as to infer that this archipelago once yeah, that's a what human the conches population. are saying. They were most likely visitors from elsewhere, not indigenous to the islands. Conches, they may have conches. spent a long time here before finding a way to return home. Since then, the island has been empty, with only a few scattered remnants of the past. As for the crystals, they've been manufactured from a particularly rare type of ore. Transparent. I believe they must have a specific function. We found a pile of stones and small flowers nearby. Do you think there's any connection? It sounds like someone wanted to commemorate the machine. Yes, but I had a look at it myself. It almost feels like someone left a heartfelt offering of Don't gratitude. voice actors already know the entire story hmm. ahead of time? <laughs> I see. And what about the rest of you? No. Who do you think would want to commemorate a machine in this no. way? No. No, we Perhaps do not. someone who was truly <laughs> grateful. Only people that had benefited directly from the machine would We don't even a see the script like until we're in there. And, and then the we only see our own lines first a lot of the time. Sometimes we get to glimpse so the lines around ours very quickly. Of course, but <laughs> this is only a hypothesis. <laughs> like, we have no How time. Existed? They're just like, okay, go. Two takes. You mean before and then I'm like, it became damaged? So. Yeah, no. I don't know. I wonder what Especially if Venti's not in a scene, I know nothing. Hmm, there is a <laughs> Hilicho presence here. Perhaps this machine's indiscriminate attack is actually supposed to be targeted at Hilichos to protect the inhabitants. Ooh. An unlikely coincidence, I would have thought. In any case, this is all speculation. If we want to get to the bottom of it, We'll need more evidence. Yes, though we don't have any clues to go on, we should sweep the area again soon. But first, let's focus our attention on the problem at hand. Look, another letter! It must Ooh. be Dodo King! Ooh! Letter. Quick, read it! Where'd this letter come from? Mysterious Dodo King, mysterious Dodo King. He sleeps alone on the southwesterly isle. Oh. The bad child made <gasps> him wait too That's long. you! Oh no! The days go dark, the stars are This rising. letter's so mean! Greedy spirit, greedy spirit, you made the moon run a ring. Keys of three colors guarded by a strange fish, the secret lies here. Do you dare to proceed? A strange More fish. More cryptic riddles? He's trying to tell us something. What could it mean? Does it have anything to do with those crystals? And also, Southwesterly Isle? Now, which island would that be? We've looked all over it's not the really island. a guess. It said which there's one? There's nothing interesting here. There is two. The island over there is really weird. Really it weird. It has a big, huge, round thingy on it. Ooh. Clee, did you go off by yourself without authorization again? No. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I just wanted to go for a walk. <laughs> as long as you didn't activate any mechanisms. Clee, next time you want to go anywhere, please tell me first, okay? okay. We'll go together. How does that Absolutely. sound? Absolutely. I thought Master Jean is always busy with other things. You really mean it? 
Of course. Of Yay! course. Yay! Okay! Hello! Hey! Careful! You can't go napping here. You'll <laughs> catch a cold. Go on. Right. I'll <laughs> take over. How is the sea? Anything to report? Nothing to mm -hmm. report, sir. Waves. <sighs> I must have fallen asleep. Uh, don't worry. No sign of the tide coming in so far. All right. Neato. Can we just sail into there? What happens if I just go right in? <coughs> oh, what's this? What happens if I stand in front of this? Will I die? All right. We did it! We got such a big crew. It's so huh? cute. Is this a shield? Doesn't look very solid, though. Doesn't. Seems like some kind of energy shield. I feel like we should be able shield. to just walk into it, but whatever. Careful, all of you. Don't touch it. Oh, too late. <laughs> it might send us flying for all we know. No, nah, it's just nothing hmm. happened. The bigger the shield, the better Dodo King must be. Sounds like Klee logic to Paimon. <laughs> there must be some reason for it to be here. A reasonable inference. I agree. An energy shield needs an energy source. Hmm. If we can find the connected hmm. devices to the source, we should be able to destroy it. All right. Let's all look for any potential devices in the vicinity. Hey, I saw this already. This does look like it could have something to do with the shield. You guys are all blind. Three devices in total. And look, the light converges in one place. Ooh. Albedo, are we able to deactivate the shield from here? Do it, Albedo. Hmm. Go. These light emitting devices each have a small frame in front of them. Looking at the shape here. It seems like something is supposed to be fixed in place. What shape is that? An oblong circle. Fan-shaped, I suppose. All right, hmm. Mr. Fancy. What could it be? We're by the ocean. This shape is a seashell, perhaps? Oh, yeah. But all the shells that we've seen were either bigger or smaller than this shape. Hmm. If it's not a shell, then it's got to be a fish scale. Ah, of course. A yes. fish scale? Right. Honorary Knight, didn't that big machine we just defeated drop something? Yes, three crystals. Oh, right, let's put those in there. Give precious things to the greedy spirit in the sea. Is that what we have to do? If my understanding is correct, honorary knight, I suggest that you place the crystals in the sea. All right, uh, yeah, let's do it. That should do it, right? Y yes, but let's do it. Where are the fish? The days grow dark, the stars are rising. Maybe this type of fish only comes out after dark? Or to put it another way, we're gonna be here all night. We gotta Catch wait fish. again. <laughs> Eat. This will be cute yeah, though. Yeah. Let's oh my go god. Fish I wanna see like an anime <laughs> episode of this whole Hold on, thing Klee. of them all hanging Will out Master together. Jean it's so come cute. Too? <laughs> Jean said if Klee wants to go anywhere, she must tell Jean, and then we can go together, right? Uh, yes, I did say that. Woo! Woo! <laughs> Ooh, fishies. What, does this not count as the next day? Ooh, fish! Wait, gimme! Come back! Yes! I got the fish, everybody! Honorary night! Over here! How are the fish that I just caught? As we suspected, they were drawn to the crystal. Miss Honorary Knight, are you gonna yes. place the fish scales? Yup. When you say now, I'll place it, alright? Okay. We finished placing the scales. Yay! Amazing! Yay! <laughs> It's my turn now, right? Yes. Yep. We'll leave that mechanism over there to you, Klee. Go, Klee, go! Okay. Please make sure you stay safe. Yep, I got it. Go, Klee. Uh, go, Klee. Klee. Go, What's Klee. wrong? What's up? I... What's up, I'm buddy? I'm worried. What? what if Dodo King really is in here? And what if he doesn't allow me to become Dodoko's family? Or if I lose We'd to him... We'd never let you lose to him. We'll kick his butt. And Dodoko can't... Be with say, me and mom will be with very Klee. sad too. Clea and Dodoko are best friends bestest forever. Bestest friend that mom ever gave me. Bestest friends and forever. I'm too scared to press it. <laughs> Miss Honorary Knight, can you press the button for me? Clea, I can't help you press it. You gotta do it. You gotta grow up sometime, little kid. Why? Because I have to hold my weapon. <laughs> this way, I can protect you. Yes. We're all here for you. Don't worry, Klee. We've all got your back. We got you, Klee. No matter who the enemy is, as long as we're here, you don't have to be afraid. Klee, Klee, Klee. Perfect. Klee, 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 I also Klee, want to Klee. see how strong the enemies on this island really are. Go. I'm here. We're all gonna fight Klee together. Things like it's gonna that? be great. What if Dodo King just wants to invite Klee to his house to chat? Or, yes, <laughs> maybe he already approves Let's of Let's talk me. this out. <laughs> Will he really approve of me? Yeah, you're Why awesome! You? You're You've adorable. always tried your best and have done a good job. Yeah! Really? Klee, you're my favoritest friend. Alright! <laughs> Leave this to me! Suck it, everyone else press, who's standing right here. Press, press the button! <laughs> <gasps> wow! It's 
that's a shop? Ooh. <gasps> Look at all those little dodicos. Ooh, a vacation. <laughs> Yay! Yay! So cute. Huh. This is... Wait, I must be confused. What is this? Relaxing? This I don't know what that is. island is like a massive gift box hidden beneath the energy shield. Is this all Albedo? There seems to be something over there. Shall we I feel like he set this all up. He's like, oh, there's something over there, guys, by the way. Wicked girl of flame, you have finally arrived. I've waited far too long. How very boring. <laughs> you dare face me, the overlord of the Dodo clan, Dodo King. Such glorious courage. Who did this voice? Though such courage is admirable. I feel like it it's is one of the characters doing a voice. Because, because Dodo King is me. <laughs> Your mother, Alice. <laughs> huh? What? Mom? Wait, <laughs> Alice? The person who wrote the Tibet travel guide? All oh, right, of course, we knew that. <laughs> and her fellow islanders. Hey there. Hello. So, how did you like it here? Was it fun? Summer skies and the ocean surf. Mm, quite the <laughs> vacation, said, no. She said kind of mean I'm letters to everyone, though. Looking for me. I'm not actually near you. The speaking device on the platform before you is none other than my personal creation. The Alice phonograph. I'm using it to convey a mother's love. Uh, you can't she be sent serious. all these letters like, I hey, got clean in my clutches. You all off, did I? <laughs> Sorry. My Clee loves playing with all sorts of small toys. As her mother, I naturally want to support her. You wicked <laughs> girl. Come to the islands. Please. You are bad, bad girl. <laughs> it's just your mom. <laughs> A pity that I can't meet you, but I will be watching She's your crazy. every move from afar, just as always. Okay. It was actually Alice. <laughs> How careless of me. Okay. Wait, what? You might find all of this a bit odd. Why would a mother so far from home expend so much effort to create such an aquatic <laughs> wonderland? I love her. Ding, ding, ding. That's correct. I've personally ding, ding, ding. been to those islands. I absolutely adore the ancient ruins and unique landscape. I prepared everything so you all could take part and enjoy the islands as well. Oh. Lee's mother also seems to have quite the free spirit. <laughs> Are any of you saying bad things about me now? No. Uh, no! Tire Bear, thanks she for cheering! <laughs> no need to be so troubled. What do you mean? Klee's mother, Alice, is an extremely enigmatic and near omnipotent sorceress. Oh. Don't be overly concerned. This is just her Whoa. character. She's a sorceress. You must have been curious about what was behind those letters. The boats, the buoys, the energy shield. Actually, I thought it was a lot of effort, but this was the only way to invite everyone here. You could have just <laughs> invited us. The islands are just <laughs> Why did you of pretend there was the like all this? Inhabitants, shipwrecks, what? <laughs> mystical machinery, countless coincidences converge here. It would just have been invite such a us over. if I didn't make these arrangements. Just send a now, little, a little invite. Guess. Everyone who received a letter Beach should party. be present. Kaya, Diluc, Razor, Jean, Barbara, and then there's the reliable and intelligent Albedo. Oh, he's her favorite. <laughs> the mysterious traveler and her good companion, Paimon. Yes. You were all invited by me to accompany Klee. Thank you all for allowing my daughter to have a memorable summer. You're welcome. Everything on the islands is a gift for you all. As thanks for keeping my little Klee company. <laughs> but when you hear this recording, I'll already be traveling in other faraway lands. The life of a traveler is such haste and amusement. <laughs> Ask the traveler next to you and you'll know. So Alice went to all these lengths because she was too busy to be with Klee? Oh. You know, mom's just like that. Aww. Now, everyone, if you're trying to find some hidden meaning in all this, I must tell you that the situation isn't as complicated as you may think. The reason why I like the city of Mondstadt is that its freedom is exactly what my daughter and I could ever hope for. My wish is simple. 
I want Klee to grow up with a curious yet kind heart. As long as she so desires, she can do anything and go anywhere. Aww. So that's it. Well, I must admit that it certainly fits Alice's style. My apologies. I misunderstood. It must be nice to have a mom who's such a character. <laughs> yep. Mom is the bestest mom. Mom, we caught fish, sailed a boat, <laughs> went swimming, and played a lot of things. Wow, we had so much fun! Except for the parts where Klee was really distraught about the Dodo King being rude. Here again. She was like really sad about it. Mother and she cried once, spirits. actually. She made Both her cry. Wild and free. So, I hope <gasps> you're happy. Mom. Yep. Summer, when I went to those islands, it also happened to be summer. Sitting on the beach, listening to the waves roll against my feet, I thought of you. <laughs> Klee, you are a child of summer, a present to me Aww. from the sea and the wind. Aww. Mom is thankful for your birth and wanted to give you something. So, Mom dressed up these islands, transformed the ancient ruins into a summer park, and used the <laughs> moniker of Dodo King. Wowee! How fun! In another world, there are tales of a wondrous island named after golden apples. Oh. Known by many names, it embodies the majestic vistas conjured by human fantasy. Oh. Mom loves that story and wanted you to enjoy the wonderful things in it. So, Mom gave you sapphire waters, pearly sands, a fantastical paradise. Aww, for that's you nice. and for those who love you. Ah, uh, that's a huh. So there were only three crystals: light red like flower petals, yeah, yeah. light blue you said like this ocean already. waves, light yellow like autumn leaves. Perhaps from Alice's perspective, this archipelago is the natural fourth crystal, located in the middle of the sea and covered by plant life. It truly is a lustrous and emerald summer crystal. Klee, just like Mom. You are of a race blessed with longevity. Oh. For us, time is like a gust of wind. Moments come and end. Oh, so Clee's gonna live a, a really long life, time. Parents huh? are but a child's first connection. Even though we don't want to be separated, there will come the day when you must walk your own path. Oh. Clee, Mom will always love you, but there are also others by your side. Friends who accompany you, teachers who educate you, people who are willing to stay on an island for you despite knowing how unusual it is. Ah, oh, summer is for everyone. No matter how life changes, no matter how many things happen this year, summer will never disappear. Just like the love between people. Uh. From now on, regardless of wherever you go, I hope you never forget how many people in this world love wow. you. Oh yes. Be sure to listen to Mr. Albedo at home. Mom will regularly return to see you two. <laughs> Thanks Actually, for rating, HMK. I, there, I sneak back to check on you and everyone We found else. the answer to the <laughs> golden <laughs> apple arp arp <laughs> fell ago. <laughs> Aunt Alice. The same Aunt as Aunt Alice. Ever. Oh, they're related. You don't think Albedo knew from the start, do you? I feel like he knew. Yeah, huh? he totally but knew. Time's almost up, so I'll stop here. Right, right. <laughs> I spent a lot of effort on this place, so you all must play your hearts out. Everyone, my darling Klee. See you next time. Okay, bye. <laughs> bye, Mom. Bye, bye. Klee seems particularly happy. Dodo King was actually Mom. I don't know why, but I'm very happy. Well, I'm glad you're happy. It doesn't matter if it's Mom blowing up Mondstadt's main gate or Mom getting grounded. Or mom writing weird letters. Clee loves her very much. Will you feel lonely without your mother? Nope. Mom is the most strongest mage, so she can keep me company no matter where she is. She never lets me feel lonely. I love mom this much. Miss Honorary Knight, do you love Clee? Yep. I also love you very much. Oh, you thank have to you, play Klee. With me lots here, or else Mom will be disappointed. All right, she sounds kind of scary, honestly. I still so. have a lot of jumpy dumpties, and I brought Nodoko here too. I'll Togo. take you swimming and fish blasting. Okay. <sighs> it's always fun fish blasting. Uh oh. Hey, come on. Let's okay, here we go. Climbing. Come on, let's go. Woo! We did it. This one we could do. Let's do this one. Everyone was being like, aw, Clee's mom is so nice. Mom goals. She literally, like, pretended her daughter was kidnapped to get people over here. And that there was, like, danger. And then, and then made her daughter cry. I feel like there are better ways to do that. <laughs> yeah! 
I want that treasure. Get out of here. Stop digging for treasure. I want it. I want the treasure. Get out of here, Hilly Churl. Yeah. My treasure. Okay. Excuse me. Thanks. Woohoo! Found it! Treasure, treasure! Wonder what we'll find inside. There's a lock on it. And it's coded too. Looks like we'll need the code to open it. We can just shatter it, can't we? Wait! What will happen if the stuff inside breaks as well? Let's find a way to unlock it instead, shall we? But since this chest contains family heirlooms and is locked using a code, that's gotta mean that the person who locks it thinks that the code they left behind is easy enough to remember. Looks like our only chance are those conches that store... That store sounds. Oh, that store sounds! That store sounds inside them. I thought I was talking about a store. Let's listen to the sounds inside those conches again. Let's hope they can give us some clues about the code. Do I have the necessary conches? Ooh, there's a conch over here. Hello, conchy. There you are. I should give the family treasure to you just to be safe. What's the code? What's the code? <laughs> Mommy's grandma said that it came from her hometown mm -hmm. far, far away. Mommy doesn't remember that place very well because she got on a boat and left her hometown when she was very little. But maybe this nursery rhyme can help keep the memory of our hometown alive. All right, what's the nursery rhyme? Is it a code? Oh. Two pass through the lonely forest. Two, one, two, one. Oh, we got the other ones, didn't we? That have that? Okay, hold on. Is it this one? Ah, oh, we don't have the first one. Okay, two paths, one river, four winds. Can't we just like guess the first number? Okay, so it said two, one, four. So it's something two, one, four. We're just gonna guess. Let's try three, two, one, four. Oh, it didn't open. Okay, let's try again. Five, two. <laughs> I am I'm a safe cracker. Safe cracker looming. <laughs> Amazing. I'm gonna go on heists. It's gonna be awesome. Woo! Did it. I didn't even need that first conch. Haha, <laughs> suckers. Let's do this one. Tick tock, tick tock, tick tock, tick tock. We're just sitting in this boat. Sitting in the boat. Sitting in a boat. Okay, it says to go over here, so let's. What? I totally didn't. I saw it clear as day! So we gotta stay on the path, huh? We gotta stay on the path. Alright, okay, here we go. I saw where it was. I like that Venti like jumped out of the boat in surprise. Like, oh no, fog! <laughs> Looks like the fog's finally behind us, but Paimon's never Oh god. Let's keep our guard up. Okay, I'm there. Okay, thank god. Oh! Wow! Oh my god, look at all this treasure! Oh my god, I'm rich! on this stone. It looks like it shows people getting ready to board a ship. Paimon doesn't know what all this means, but let's record this mural down first. Quest complete. I did it. I'm the best. Who knew we'd find a mural like this one on the island? Still, we can't make complete sense out of the story these murals depict just by looking at them. Maybe there might be similar murals on the surrounding islands nearby. Let's look around and see what we can find. Other murals, you say? I want to play you another Klee. tune. Let's pull for Clee right now. We can do seven. All right. Come on, Clee. Nope. Nope. Ooh, another official. Nice. Another official. Whoa, she's going to be great. No. Come on. Here we go. It was a book. I think that was our. Oh, we have one more. All right, last one. No. Oh well. Oh, I have eight now. Oh, okay. So I can get one of these. All right. Good. 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 One more. Here we go. Come on, Clee. Come to us, Clee. No. She's like, no thanks. I think that's gonna take too long to find these things, so I'll do that maybe on my own. I think that'll be all for today. And we have to do this teapot thing still too. Look, I've got this. Dane's leaf thing that I gotta do. We've got a lot to do. So as for now, I'm gonna go. But yeah, I will see you very, very soon. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.